so, um, I would actually make a video going in on certain points of this episode, um, which I normally do. And maybe you can see it, I'm just, I just can't right now. I, I can't make an entire video because I have to... I just watched the episode and it was amazing. It was awesome. Seriously, the animation fucking amazing and perfect. And but the end, like the fucking cliffhanger. I know Bright promised us that Cora would end up in a happy place, but I mean, people consider heaven or the spirit world, whatever you would, they consider it a happy place. So. Right now, I'm really, really scared. <laughs> I said it in the reaction video. Um, I really hope that <clears throat> Korra's defense mechanism somehow triggered the Avatar State and for some, in some miraculous way, made it possible for her to protect everyone in the Avatar state in some way, like maybe <clears throat> bend the, 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 the spirit laser thing, like maybe she can bend that away from them or, or with earth bending. Yeah, no, because it went right through a fucking mountain. So that's not going to help. I just, I really hope that. <clears throat> In some way, Korra is able to protect all of them because if this is how it ends, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fucking flip my shit. I I swear to God, this is this can be how it ends. I just, I don't even know. <laughs> Just the idea of Korra ending is bad enough already, and then we have this fucking ending. Are you kidding me? It's like... <clears throat> they, they can't do this to us. They just can't. It finally started to look, well, better and things, like... <sighs> My hat cannon is still the career as one how of a lesbian. I mean, only in the end she said, I love you, Batar. Like, that's the first time she said that. If I can rem remember that correctly. I just... They can't end it like this. They can't. I'm, I'm so fucking scared for next week. And there's already so much shit going on for me. I have to pack for, like, my, I'm going to the United States in, in January. I still have to pack for that, but I can't start until my moms get back. Which is December 18th, they will be back. Um, one of my moms borrowed my suitcase, so I have to pack because I'm gonna move next year. Newsflash. <laughs> so, I'm already starting to pack and my room is one big mess right now and I know Cora is gonna end next week so we have that coming up and then this fucking cliffhanger I just maybe it's a good thing that I need to pack because and hopefully it'll distract me like I'm gonna need it. I just, I, I don't even, I don't even know. I just, holy shit, Brike, what the fuck? This is one hell of a cliffhanger. I swear to fucking God. I just, <clears throat> oh my God, guys, I'm, I'm. I hope I'm not the only one who's who's being like this because then I would be fucking embarrassed. 
I just... And Asami had her own outfit! Like... She was wearing the outfit in which we kind of got to know her. And I'm... Oh, just... And Wu finally being, like, some kind of a king, like, he, he could be, and, 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 and Bolin, he tries to get Varric and Julie together, and, of course, Varric is being, like, yeah, he's being himself, and I got really, I, I really freaked out about that. That was so fucking cute, and I really loved that Julie st stood up for herself. But, like, Bolin has grown so much. And, 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 like, Sujin and Lin are finally on good terms again. Uh, we have, like, Pema, who is... She is really underappreciated. Pema, who is like, okay, I'm gonna help, and, um... I just... every Everyone and everything... It, it, I'm sorry, I'm just getting emotional because I rem remember how I started on book one and was like, okay, let's see what this is gonna bring because, of course, we all... Well, most of us have seen Avatar The Last Airbender, pretty much grew up with it, and then we suddenly get to see my sequel, Legend of Korra, and now we're on the end, like, it's it's ending, like, the entire Avatar universe, it's it's going to end, and that's that's really freaky and scary, and, and then we have this fucking cliffhanger, we have to wait for an entire week until we find out what happens, it's a fucking finale, and I'm, 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 I'm legit scared for what's going to happen next week. I'm legit scared and I can't even if I wanted to that's that's why I'm doing the, the this review ish video without watching the episode again I I can't I just just the idea alone it, it's making oh my gosh there I go again I just I can't watch this another time like maybe maybe in a year <laughs> or or something but <sighs> Like, you can't do this to them. I just, my fucking heart breaks. Like, everyone was there. Like, Sujin and her entire family. And, but Lin was separated. And, 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 and there was Tenzin with his family, with their babies. And, and Pema. And, and Bolin, Julie, Varric, Mako, Bolin. Asami, Korra, even fucking Batar Jr. and I just I really hope this is gonna I really I I really really hope that um that Korra is going Avatar State and just miraculously somehow saves everyone because I I can I can't fucking deal if this is how it's gonna be. I'm seriously so scared and I'm just I I can I can't handle this if this is how it's going to be and It seems so silly. It's a fucking cartoon, and... <laughs> well, I guess me crying again shows how much um, Legend of Korra means to me. I guess, like... Ugh. I mean, I met so many incredibly amazing people, talented people, and really, I'm, I made so much friends because of Legend of Korra on Tumblr, mostly. I mean, I met my fucking girlfriend because of Legend of Korra, because we both are fans of Legend of Korra, and we both ship Korasami big time. So yeah, of course, Legend of Korra means a lot to me, not just because of all the people I met because of it, but just the show itself. It taught me so much, just like 
a fraternal as airbender taught me so incredibly much. I mean, we have Cora, a woman, being the, 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 she's badass. She has her insecurities, she has her flaws, yes, but she's being really, well, she's a very realistic um, character, and I can really relate to her on different levels, so yeah, um, and the idea that it's going to end already breaks my heart, but now this. <laughs> if this is if this is how it's gonna be, I'm I'm not sure if I'll ever be able to accept it. <laughs> I just really hope Brike is not gonna do that to us. Because I I, I, I don't even know anymore. I, I, how how do English? How do how do words? <sighs> you know, sorry for being like this. I just I just can't stop it. And yeah, well, this is this is me. This is how who I am. This is how I am. Yeah, I am emotional. I get emotional really easily and. Basically, I'm an emotional wreck. That's, it's, it's just how it is. I'm, I'm sorry. I just, no, I'm not gonna apologize for having feelings. <laughs> I just, okay. This is long. This is being. This has been long enough. I'm gonna shut this down and and and, and I'm sorry for rambling and and being one big mess. I'm really sorry. I just, yeah, I can't even say that. I hope you enjoyed this episode because how can you enjoy it, like, after that ending, after that fucking cliffhanger? <laughs> just, um, which I also forgot to mention in my previous video, like, the actual reaction video, just, um, feel free to comment to, um, like or or subscribe if you want to i mean that's up to you obviously um i just thanks for watching i guess and um hopefully see you next week if i survive and um to everyone good luck because i know we all are going to need it. We already need it, probably, so, yeah. <laughs> okay, well, bye. And, yeah, sorry, I guess. Okay, bye. <laughs>